Ladies and gentlemen, it is your lovely host here. It is Team Rai Rai. And how are you doing on this Wednesday's edition? I am doing very well. I have social media accounts, and don't worry, I discuss that matter after this part of the video is over. Now, sit back, relax, put your feet up, grab some meat, or grab some drink, or maybe, just maybe, you want to chill like a villain and hear my thoughts, my opinions on this subject. And of course, the link will be down below, or the article will be down below. Either or, it will be down below. Let's get into this conversation, shall we? We shall. Okay, now probably a lot of you are aware, or not aware, that there was rumors going around that they're going to have another draft after the pay-per-view called, or premium event called, uh, Class of the Castle. You know, the next night of all, or the following one on SmackDown, but that's not the case. Here's some brand new information. It was reported earlier this month that the talent backstage expect that the annual W draft to take place after the class of the castle. This was due to several Raw stars being booked for the September 9th episode of SmackDown and SmackDown stars being booked for the September 5th and 12th episode of Raw. However, it appeared that the WWE draft may not happen next month. See? People just start rumors backstage. I mean, they're just mind knowledge in it, you know? So, once again, you can't believe these resources until it's official, official, people. Okay, now, here's one more thing. According to FIFO selection, several Raw stars have been un unbooked for from the September 9th SmackDown. USA Network sources have reported spoke to telling about the draft not taking place in the near future. I know I'm not saying that correctly. Now, in your opinion, in your opinion only, do we really need a draft? In 2023, I'm sorry, 2022 or beyond, my opinion is absolutely not. Just end the flipping brand split and just use the guys and gals are your main players, okay? Now, the other guys and gals could take the back seat, okay? Now, I know they don't like that, but this brand split is doggy doo doo, doggy crap, however you want to say it. Maybe they'll do it the correct way under the Triple H era, or maybe not, you know? Now, last time we had a draft, it was pointless. It really was, because... Actually, I think all the ones are pointless, because they don't follow through. I've been mentioning it last time I made a video on the WWE draft. So, I think this is going to happen probably after WrestleMania. It makes perfectly sense, you know? Why do it now, you know? Because it'd probably be more shipped. And hopefully, under the Triple H resume, I mean, era, he don't use the term wild card or something like that, what McMahon did. That was very not, not necessary to have it. It was kind of stupid, these rules, but that's McMahon for you. So all the information down below, if you guys are curious or uncurious, so it's down below. Now you guys can follow me on Instagram, Twitch, Twitter, TikTok, and even my own Facebook page. It's called The Robert Show. We can discuss this. Sorry, we can discuss this. We can discuss the NFL games coming up very, very soon. Um, we can discuss about college football and beyond. But don't make fun of the host. That is no good. Have a good one, and I'll be back tonight for some time. Stay safe. Stay positive and that wraps it up. Thanks for watching. And hit that bell, you will get a notification.